Welcome to another video of Kion.SmartHome. This is Ali Reza and today I'm going to talk about a new device that I got today, Etherpass Z-Wave Wall Reader, in another word Z-Wave Keypad. As soon as I got this device I added it to Vero Control Unit. It is fully compatible with Vera and using this device in Vera you can add or remove pin codes, restrict pin codes in addition to receiving notifications. Also this device works with IC cards which in its box there are two IC cards. Uh, stay with me to see how you can add this device to where a control you need and how it works in that. By the way, do not forget to subscribe my channel if you are interested in watching videos about Z-Wave products. In order to use that device, a 12 DC power supply is needed. Powering on the device red wire and black wire must be connected to power supply the device has six different colors of wire the red one is plus 12 V the black one is or let's say the black wire is ground the blue wire is normally closed the white color the wire white color is come of the relay the green wire is normally open the yellow is used for resetting the device before using the device it is recommended that the device must be reset to its factory default for doing so yellow wire and black wire must be connected to each other for seven seconds and after the D sound the connection must be released now the device is reset the device has the pa has the admin password by default it is one two three four four five six it can get nine admin passwords for entering the password the reset button must be pressed which means a holding yellow wire and black wire together and releasing quickly after the D sound the admin password must be entered after that ENT must be touched for entering passwords one must be touched then the ID of the password I enter 001 then the password again the password this device can get up to 230 passwords the IDs are defined from 0 to 230 ID 1 to 9 are admin passwords for adding admin user as you can see in the manual of the device reset button must be pressed input admin password plus ENT button press 1 then the ID of the password must be entered from 001 to 009 then input the new input password must be entered or the IC card password should be 4 to 6 digits if it is less than 6 digits please input ENT to end after entering the password okay I have changed the 
admin password let's add the device to Vera control unit in Vera I go to devices section I click at device from the list I select generic Z wave device then click next next Vera enters into inclusion mode before including the wall reader to Vera control unit excluding it or running an, an exclusion is essential I click on retry Vera begins the unpairing process while Vera is in exclusion mode the device must be entered to inclusion or exclusion mode 2 to be excluded how the reset button must be pressed then master code must be entered then ENT touched and zero must be touched it is excluded and then Vera enters into inclusion mode in order to include the wall reader to Vera while Vera is in inclusion mode after running exclusion we have to put the device into inclusion mode by pressing the reset button entering master code then ENT must be touched after that zero must be touched Vera detected a device in device name section I enter a name for the device at the bottom of the page we can set a room for the device then by clicking on finish Vera starts configuring the device Vera says please wait for the device to be configured this process usually takes from 5 to 90 seconds during this time we mustn't, we mustn't do anything with Vera control unit wall reader is added to Vera control unit using Vera you can unlock the device or lock it by going to the setting of the device in Vera entering pin codes page you can see that one pin code is added this pin code is the pin code I enter using the wall reader the pin codes that are entered using the wall reader cannot be restricted pin codes from 1 to 9 are admin pay attention to that using Vera you can add pin codes by clicking add pin code pin code must have a name then after entering it I click on save pin code it will be added to wall reader you can see that the second pin code is enter if I enter pin codes to wall reader using Vera control unit I can restrict the pin code by date or days of the week by default is always valid let's add an IC card to wall reader for doing so I press the reset button enter the master pin code then ENT then 1 then I pass the IC card from in front of the wall reader in Vera you can see that another pin code is added 
Now let's test the IC card. It was locked, now it's unlocked. After a while, it is locked again. Let's delete the code number 10, which is the IC card from Vera. In front of the code, I click delete, then OK. I received error. I have to try deleting the pin code later. Let's test the pin codes. First of all, I enter the first admin password. We can see where our shows that user code one enter let's try ali results pin code you can see vero shows that user ali reza entered so using eserpass wall reader you can receive full notifications of the device. I add another pin code using the wall reader. For doing so, I press the reset button, enter master pin code, touch ENT button, then one, then the ID of pin code, then enter pin code. Now I enter a four digit pin code, ENT 4651, again ENT. It is added. Let's go to the pin codes page of the device in Vera. You can see that code three is entered. It does not show the pin code but you can delete it from Vera. There is a point here. If I enter the pin code into the wall reader, the device is unlocked. After a few seconds, it is locked again. By the way, I have connected this uh, multimeter to the white wire and the green wire, which is normally open. So, when I use the wall reader, it does not, okay. It is unlocked. After a few seconds, it is locked again. But, if I unlocked from Vera control unit in the device setting, I clicked unlocked. It remains unlocked and you have to lock it manually. This is one issue I faced you testing this device. So if you control the device using Vera control and you unlocked it, you have to lock it yourself. Okay, I go to pin codes page. Code number 10 is related to the, to the IC card. I delete it. Now you can see that the IC card does not work. And if I try to use it,
we can see that Vera displays incorrect pin code entered access denied for a few seconds access is denied and you cannot use wall reader after a while you get the access so to enter pin codes to the wall reader you can use wear control unit or the wall reader itself using wall reader I press the reset button then enter the master code then touch ENT one then enter the ID of the pin code after that you have to enter the pin code if the pin code you are entering the ID of the pin code you are entering is from 1 to 9 you have to enter the pin code twice For adding the IC card, reset button must be pressed, then master code must be entered, one, then the ID of pin code, I have to put the IC card in, in the middle of the device. It is added. You can remove the codes using wall reader by pressing the reset button, entering the master code, touching ENT, then two then entering the ID that you want to delete it will be deleted and you can see that immediately Vera deletes the pin code from its list I hope you have enjoyed this video if you have any question do not hesitate to ask bye bye